Hey everyone, we are FairUp, and we envision a world where tourists always make the places they visit better. Our team works inside the cooperative fairbnb.cop, which already launched a short-term rental platform, and we at FairUp, we are adding experiences to the mix. Tourism in the pursuit for profit um, started pushing out locals and local businesses. The result is the degradation of the local economy, culture, and community. It's a beautiful industry on the outside, but an ugly one on the inside. You can learn more about the topics in the movie, like The Last Tourist, or in many articles that discuss the industry. But what we find disturbing is that all the main solutions talk about educating tourists and putting all the pressure on us, the individuals, on how we travel. And that simply doesn't work. M locals in major cities have been screaming, tourists go home for years now. And why does this, this happen? Money doesn't stay in the local community. Tourism offer is optimized for fr profit, extracting cultural and natural resources. And tourism flows are unevenly distributed. But we think we can do better. Tourism can be the force for good. Um, we have the solution. We are fair up, uh, a marketplace that connects tourists with local experiences, and we donate social, uh, we donate a part of the commission to the social, local social projects. How do we do that? We find projects that contribute to the SDGs, like no poverty, zero hunger, decent work, and economic growth. For example, in Slovenia, we signed a contract with the organization Kings of the Street, which is a non-profit that prevents homelessness and tries to improve their life. And they are a great example uh, because they are not just a social projects that we try to donate to, but they are also an experience, a really transformative one. You go on a tour with an ex-homeless person that is part of the recovery program of the organization, uh, and they take you uh, and uncover invisible sides of the Slovenian capital. These kind of projects and these kind of experiences are what we want more in tourism. But why are these kind of pro projects and what kind of these kind of experiences not present on the digital plat platforms that we know today? It's because these nonprofits, non-governmental organizations, artisans of all sorts, farmers, scientists, they don't have the knowledge, time, or the digital skills to be part of the platform economy uh, that tourism is part of. That's why we've built a special feature inside of our platform that allows our local partners that we educate and train, we call them scouts, to find experiences in their local areas, onboard the experience providers, and manage their profile instead of them. In return, of course, they earn part of the commission. In the past two years, we've been on the field a lot. We talked with thousands of providers, um, and we saw that there is a need for hundreds of, of these kind of providers that need the help of a scout. Uh, when we launched our project in Slovenia, we onboarded 20 scouts that found more than 70 experiences and onboarded it on our MVP platform at the time. Even with, when we talked with all the tourism providers uh, that got the help from the scout, they were happy to give up up to 15% of their revenue just to have these young students and our locals to help them become part of the digital platform economy. And so with our unique model, we try to solve the problems of the industry. In our case, money stays in the local community, tourism offer is more conscious and inclusive, 
and tourism flows outside the normal hotspots as we add experiences to the platform that were previously not part of the digital platform economy. Our next steps are to launch uh, the project in Ljubljana and Venice. We will try to onboard 30 experiences in each city um, and, and test uh, Ljubljana and Venice are going to be our testing ground. After that, we will try to expand our network to other um, countries and cities that, were, that are also already part of our Fair VMB short-term network. We have a huge network uh, already waiting for us. So we have partners in the, of the Big Issue Foundation in the UK, Archie in Italy. Um, our FairUp startup has also been accepted to the Social Tides um, growth track, which is supported by the Google.org, where we also get mentoring support and some additional finances. Here you can see a sneak peek of our product. Here is an, an example of the experience uh, from my region, from the Slovenian Istria. We are now really close to finishing the plat platform development and are, are going to be ready to onboard hosts and scouts in the Q1 of 2023. And we would like to launch the product in the spring uh, of, of the next year. So at the end, I would like to invite you to plan your travels for Ljubljana or in to Venice in the spring of 2023. Add values to your experiences, fare up the places you go to. Thank you.